I am Vrinda. I am a widow. Here in Vrindavan, I live in Bhut Gali. I live with many other sisters like me. We all come from different regions of India after our husbands died. And later, we found peace here. Though most of my sisters are from Bengal, we are now just known as the Widows of Vrindavan. You might not believe this, but we are happy here. Very happy. We wake up at 4 in the morning, have a bath and then go to the temple. These small, crooked by-lanes of Vrindavan are very beautiful in the morning. And why not? These lanes have been the habitat of the one with the flute, his friends and his mischief. What place can be more beautiful and pure? I can hear only his name and only him, my Krishna. Yes, I can dance. When I dance to his tunes and sing his songs, I feel as if I was named Vrinda by my family for this very day. Ma, Baba, I miss you very much. At times when someone asks about them, my eyes well up with tears. I miss my parents and my children. This is Vimla. Poor thing. She hasn't spoken to anyone from her family for two years now. She says she misses everyone at home. But she's lived her life and does not want to be a burden. But she misses her babua. By singing hymns, I get six rupees a day, three rupees for singing bhajans for four hours in the morning and three rupees for the same in the evening. Some days are better when I even get a hundred grams of rice and life goes on. In this small room, under this slow ceiling fan, I'm afraid. What if I fall sick? What will happen? Who will take me to a doctor? Who will treat me? And if I can't go and sing the hymns, how will I feed myself? Maybe that's the reason why some of us beg. I don't like to beg, but maybe that's what you call helplessness. I also want dignity. I want love. I also want to be needed. You know, God listens to us. He sent Didi to us. She understands us. She talks to us. She laughs with us. She hears our pain and tries to solve our problems. She is from Maitri and she is our Sakhi. She's even arranged afternoon meals for us. We don't have to worry about cooking food. Every day, I get fresh dal, sabzi, roti and chawal and sometimes even halwa. I don't know after how long I feel that I've eaten real food. I feel much stronger now. And we don't have to stand in a queue for food at the temple. And you know what? She's also arranged for a doctor and medicines for us. Now it seems that our problems will end soon. But to tell you the truth, now it feels like the day starts with the name of Krishna, passes with the name of Krishna, and at dusk too, I feel the same. I know, when I close my eyes, 
I will be chanting your name. Radhe Radhe Hare Krishna Hare Krishna Hare Krishna Hare Krishna Hare 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 Ram Hare Ram 